So today I'm going to show you a progression from the regular shoulder press. Okay? If you want a little more cross body core engagement, what you're going to do, step one, remember belly button is in, so your spine is braced. We are not arching. You're braced like someone's going to come up and punch you. Brace here, okay? Squeeze that belly button in. You're going to start with your hands overhead. Notice my Ears are covered by my shoulders. I'm not far back and I'm not way out here. Right overhead. So you're gonna start here, keep your feet hip width apart, drop one and then the other. So the difference is instead of starting here and doing this, it's harder because you're starting at the top and you are controlling the rate of descent. You're also not moving, okay? Try not to shift your weight at all Keep everything very <laughs> locked and loaded, as I like to call it, okay? You can also twist if that feels better, as long as you maintain that integrity of the kinetic chain. So you wanna make sure you're covering your ears and not going forward, okay? Second variation is a single leg version. So belly button's in, chest is up, lift one leg, 90 degrees, if you can. If you can only go here, that's fine. Try not to let your hips sag or drop or anything else. Belly button in. Lift the arch of the foot you're standing on. And here we go. Try not to hike to compensate, okay? Anybody can lift a leg and move all over. The goal here is this challenges your core, okay? So, to recap, step one, start ahead, overhead, and drop. Step two, you can start here, lift a leg, come up. Step three, start overhead and drop. Now whether you rotate or not doesn't make any difference.